to Walsh, Nohal, Gali, arrived by 10.30 for a guided tour. And it has Kokobakamanga Beach Club, turtle tours and water sports. Excuse me. What is that? I don't know, it's supposed to be good. Life and happiness. And money. Cheers.
happened to me right in front of my face. <laughs> Right. Tonight was our last night on a Caribbean island. I'm back in our cabin right now. I am so tired. This mango is so good. I'm trying to find something to watch on TV. I went to a show, but I'm tired. I just want to eat this mango and go to bed. I didn't tell you guys too much about what it was yesterday. St. Lucia. St. Lucia was very fun. We went to, we did a tour, and then we got dropped off at one of their beaches. And today we went to Barbados. We did another tour, and then we went to the beach again. And then there was a night market. We went to that, which was really cool, as you guys can see in the clips. Um, let's talk about some of my favorite places. Favorite place was St. Thomas. St. Thomas, their water, Megan's Bay. So peaceful. Like it was. I will definitely come back just to get that piece again because it was ridiculous how serene it was. Um, then I really like Antigua's sand. Like I love their sand. It felt like pillows. Like their sand was so nice that's why i really like antigua and then today barbados their sand was so white and their water was so clear like clear like most of the waters are like you can see like it's clear but barbados water clear okay period clear i think the clearest closest to that was antigua so definitely we'll try to come back to those places because those are my favorite um, literally what you do in the islands kind of shapes your experience, like who you interact with. So I'll definitely say try to interact with a lot, not a lot of people, but try to interact with people, um, so you can make the most out of your experience. You don't have to book excursions through the cruise. Um, I think it's better if you like book like maybe one or two that you really want to do. And then everything else you could, re you could really wing it because it's taxis and the taxis are pretty cheap. It's like, it's less than thirty dollars per person, depending on what you do. And if you really know what you want to do, you can just get a taxi, and it'll take you to wherever you want to go. Um, it's just you make make sure you get back back to the ship before the time it leaves. Um, and what we did was we like tried to time it so that we that way we at least had like an hour before, or maybe like an hour and a half before the ship leaves, so that way we don't get left because you don't want to get left in Puerto Rico or Antigua. And it's not Antigua. I'm so sorry. It's Antigua. Williams told me it's Antigua, okay? But, today they had lobster for dinner. So good. The tacos that we had at the night festival in Barbados, good. And, um, tomorrow I'm gonna wake up, go to the gym, like, test it out, see what it's like. Because I need to exercise. I'm so sad to be going back home. Like, it was like my last day on a beach. I'm next week I'm gonna be like, wow, this time last week I was really on a beach right now. I got a tan. And if you haven't followed me on Instagram or Twitter, follow me there because I've been posting all my pictures, all the looks, all the fits. All right, I'm not closing out this vlog yet, but I'm closing out today. So I'll talk to you guys later. Let's take this over